Welcome to This Week in Anime History, where we look at some of the major moments in anime history that happened this week historically, if that makes sense. Not historically, historically. Anyway, starting off with Astro Boy right there. Um, actually, all of the stories from this week are from anime uh, uh, premiering in America. So back in September 7th, 1963, Astro Boy premiered in America. And it's important for a couple of reasons. One is that it helped really start anime fandom in America. We tend to think of anime fandom uh, over here as a relatively new thing, but no, there were folks watching Astro Boy back in the day here in the U.S., and this is the same year it came out in Japan. Uh, Astro Boy uh, 1963 started in January in Japan. We got it only nine months later. Obviously, there was a dubbing process, um, but yeah, we got it pretty darn quickly, all things considered. The folks at ABC knew a, uh, knew a property with some legs on it, when they saw it. So, pretty cool that we got Astro Boy so quickly, and it got you know, a really small anime fandom going at that point. Then, um, that would continue on to the launch of Sailor Moon in 1995 in America. September 11th, we got the premiere of Sailor Moon here in the U.S., and that's important because there hadn't really been much in the way of anime for girls in America yet. Certainly uh, no shows aimed squarely at the girl market that I know of. Now, there are a few shows that showed up a little bit here and there on you know, an occasional channel in syndication, but nothing sort of um, you know, nationwide and widespread, again, that I know of. And Sailor Moon really hit big, hit hard. A lot of folks watched it, boys and girls, and uh, really helped to uh, uh, you know, push forward that fandom for America over here. And a few years later, we got a show, I don't know if you've heard it, called Pokemon, which aired in America on, on September 8th, 1998. Now, up until this point, there certainly was anime airing in America, but it was far from a household name. Uh, most folks, if you talk to them on the street and ask them about, you know, cartoons, um, and you mentioned anime, they would have no idea what that word meant. It would just be a, you know, an alien word. What's anime? What's anime? Pokemon changed that. Pokemon was absolutely, and I was there was the show that um, made the average American person aware of the idea. There was this Japanese animation that was very distinctive and that kind of did its own thing. Um, also, especially in the wake of the Pokemon um, seizure incident and the massive adoption of the card game and all the gambling stuff, uh, gambling controversy around Pokemon. So it certainly made a lot of headlines and suddenly now folks knew what anime was. So... Um, if you can't imagine a world where folks didn't know what anime is or what anime was, that was the world before Pokemon, and Pokemon definitely changed that, at least here in the U.S. So those are some major moments in anime history of the past week. Hope you found this inter interesting. Thanks for watching.